This one you so pause it and play it back. Marketing research for the Solo Cup company. Do you mind answering a few questions? Sure. We're, we're gonna be filming, is that alright? Okay, can you hold this? Okay. Now, how much money do I get? Oh my god! Oh my god. Have you guys seen this cup before? Yes. yes. Where have you seen it before? Um, TV, commercials, movies. <laughs> Everywhere. Before. Everywhere. Parties. 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 Family house. function, a party. Yeah, like party. a casual, like, cookout type thing. Like, Parties. Parties. A birthday party? Okay, cool. Any given night, uh, I see at least, probably at least 50 red Solo Cups. Um, so I'm very familiar with this product. I guess. Uh, how, how often do you interact with it? Um, actually, I have a... A brass goblet, so not very often. <laughs> what kind of party was it? Like, what were people doing? What kind of music was playing? It was actually my 21st <laughs> birthday party like a couple of days ago. Awesome. awesome. <laughs> oh my god. Getting sodas at various places. Okay. Describe this object as a form. Well, it's kind of cylindrical with one side closed off, the other side turned out a little bit to. Probably made from a mold. It has all these little ridges. There's normally a line. Um, they represent like different sizes of drinks. I, I, my experience with red cups doesn't really involve measuring. It's efficient. It's efficient? Yeah. Gets the job done? It's comfortable to hold. The color is compatible. Common? Yeah, common. Fun. <laughs> yeah. Oh, do you think it's pretty? Why, why is it ugly? I think red solo cups are fundamental in many games and activities. Um, beer pong. Soda. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes like snacks. When you think of red, like aside from the red cup, what, what does red make you think of? Power. That's a good one. <laughs> Red's passion. Red's what? Love, passion. I've heard that red makes you hungry. <laughs> it washes your nails. It washes my nails. Um, like and lust. Yeah. Lust? Love, yeah. I guess you could say. Obscene. Right. Uh, a little unnecessary. Yeah. What do you no. think of? Is it like sex and like just... <laughs> is it like date rape and stuff? Is this an... Why do you think they chose red instead of another color? It's a happy color. Like the red sheet is, uh, is a temptation for the bull, the red cup is sort of a temptation for students, for adolescents sort of ben egging them on analogy. to come and charge and drink and make mistakes and destroy their bodies and lives, whatever. <laughs> what do love and passion have to do with the red cup? Well, after the party, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you give me a drink, it's in a solo cup. I mean, but it also has like a home. presence as well. And what do you think about the color of the cup? No problem. <laughs> I guess like red is like a wild color. Like, you know, parties, cool. like, yeah, cool. it tends to get, like, crazy. The color catches your eye. Okay. It's like a red stop sign. <laughs> you know, it catches your eye. Right. It's red, and it stands out. There's a song about it. Is it really? How does it go? It goes, red solo cup, I'll fill you up. Let's have a party. Jonathan's over there. Jonathan, do you know any of the words? The red solo cup song. Don't think color and function are necessarily intertwined when it comes to cups. Okay, so we were gonna change the color of the cup to purple? Uh-huh. Um, no, I don't think so. How come? Sometimes change is good, but not on this case. How come? When you see like a red cup, you're like, oh, it's a solo cup, right away. Right. A purple would just be too different. Okay. Thumbs up for purple? What about for red, thumbs up? Thumbs down for red. <laughs> it's like, this is what they have at like every party. Is this a party the cup? red cup is the party it, cup. It's a red cup. Red cups are party cups, right? Uh, well, first, like the red, I don't know, it's such a like iconic. Yeah, for the company, I guess, like for the right. cup. Like the red, red is like a color where you want, it's like a color like, where it's like, man, turn up, fun. like time to yeah, party, purple on, is like, like, uh, like this cup, you would put anything in it. Purple, you might put some wine, yeah, some juice. Yeah. Purple's a royal color, mm -hmm. so who do we associate it with? We don't have royalty in this country. Something that's unique to uh, the United States. States. And it's also unique to a certain demographic. It's uh, a certain age group. 
Because I don't know. It's not as neutral as her. Great. Yeah. <laughs> if you were in a room and everyone was holding this cup, what song do you imagine would be playing? Smells like Teen Spirit from Nirvana, maybe. Oh, yeah. Something Ooh. like with a nice bass. Well, like, mm. <laughs> just sitting there like, just ready like, to like, Just makes you enjoy so everything. Just like, more. Just like yes. <laughs> Just some kind of, the vibe I don't know is how better. To describe, just some kind of body movement. So, yeah. yeah. What song is playing? Uh, call me maybe. <laughs> that's like mm. something. Yeah. Mm. I don't know what's happening. Like Not that. even like that. Just like you know what? Like the kind of techno music now, where the bass just, just like something for a minute. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. Fifty Cent. <laughs> what song would be playing if it was a purple cup? Um, some like I Buddy Williams, with you, do, some Michael Jackson, do, do, do. some Motown, oh, some like some, 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 some kind of like toe tapping music, yeah, some, some, some two step, some two step. Yeah, yeah like a Footloose by Kenny Loggins. <laughs> what yeah. about a clear cup? What song? Um, it seems like a middle school dance. Um, <laughs> like that's just all. Like I'm in the morning, feeling like Bee Gees, something like that. You know? That is <laughs> clear cup for. Then you're like at home with your mom, <laughs> listening to like Michael Bublé. <laughs> the re original reason that we chose red was because uh -huh. the company, the cup actually started as the symbol for the Communist Party. Oh my god! Oh wow! <laughs> really? Yeah. I did not know that. What do you think about that? Oh wow! <laughs> How does that make you feel? Weird. <laughs> Weird. Yeah. Maybe like I don't want to buy <laughs> red solo cup. Right. That's. Maybe maybe that's why we use clear cups. Now, like the meaning of it has changed, so it's not doesn't really scream communism anymore. It just screams a fun cup. Okay, awesome. Thank you very much for your time. Okay. Appreciate it.